Hi, my name is Andrew Steele, and I would like to welcome you to my presentation on Host-Based Intrusion Detection Systems, or HIDS. So, this is a system that can detect intrusions that happen into on the individual hosts. And so the way that this works is that you have a server set up, and then you have agents installed on each of the different devices in your workplace. And each of the agents will send information to the server, and they will detect a whole lot of things that maybe happen on your system. Um, so it does a really good job of describing things that change uh, when an attack occurs. And in some cases, it can quarantine or stop an effect uh, from something, you know, basically dynamically. Like it doesn't have a signature that it matches to a, an attack. It just says, this is a real suspicious activity. I'm going to stop it for now. Um, it can detect a lot of attacks that when they happen and alert administrators. OSEC is a free open source host-based intrusion detection system that Trend Micro graciously uh, gives to the world to use. It is for Linux and Windows systems. The server runs on Linux or a Unix-based system like Mac, and then the agents run on Windows. OSEC can do a lot of things. It can detect rootkits um, because it, it's really, really good at analyzing what's going on and the different system files happening, and it can find files that are hiding and doing suspicious activity, and it can point you to them. It can perform log analysis, so a lot of that is simply collecting the logs from all kinds of different programs on your hosts and then send it to the servers. And then also analyze what looks uh, like a problem, what looks suspicious, and it can also monitor the Windows registry. It can let you know when changes happen in the Windows registry, and changes in the Windows registry are very commonly associated with problems, attacks, um, malicious installations, and so forth. Integrity checking is similar to monitoring the Windows registry, except that integrity checking is for all programs, all files on the hard drive. It can detect changes and let you know when. Now, in some cases, it's viewed as a bit too broad and not descriptive enough in what the problem like, is. But again, this is about telling you what happened, what changed. Um, and so you can better understand what kind of problem happened if an antivirus didn't find something happening. Active response is the exception to a lot of the other things where instead of describing to you what happens, it is going to dynamically look at it and see is this a malicious behavior and quarantine certain activities. The log analysis options you have, you, there's a lot. You can collect logs from all kinds of different programs like FTP servers, mail servers, databases like MySQL, uh, Apache servers for web-based stuff, firewalls. Again, firewall, like that's a big part to let you know when an attack happens, what port is it happening over, where is the traffic going to, what kind of, what kind of traffic, so on and so forth. Logs from your network-based intrusion text system, antiviruses, VPN concentrators, and the Windows logs. So when you install OSEC, you have to install the server on a Linux or a Unix-based system and then you install the agent on your Windows machines. And then admins can use a web interface in order to access all the information collected. These are some screenshots for installing it on Windows. This is the interface that the admin can go to. It's really convenient to check on everything that's been reported. So these are very powerful tools today. Attacks happen more frequently. They're better attacks, they're, uh, they're more complex, and also businesses have more and more things based in technology, and what, there's, just, there's more to lose nowadays, and even though we have a lot of really good products for preventing these problems, when the problems do happen, when the attacks do happen, we have to be able to understand them better. And these tools, these the host-based intrusion detection system will let us understand better what kind of attacks happen. So you should familiarize yourself with these programs and use them and you can serve your business better.